Hello everyone, welcome or welcome back to my channel. Welcome to the start of my February haul. Um, we're not going to talk about the fact that my fingernail is missing, but yeah. I think I'm going to get into this order first. So first up, I have an order from Joy of Planning. I've never ordered from the shop before, but Maria ordered for Black Friday and I watched her haul and then like immediately went out and placed this order. So got quite a bit of things. So I think these are all freebies. So it came with this little die cut. So I'm gonna assume Okay, so every 16 sheets, because they have this little sticker on here, you get a free sheet. And then I came with this February um, like calendar. Why can I not talk? And then we have the February freebies. So we have these girls. They're kind of like... Love. I love how she puts like the sheet number on there too and then I'm gonna assume that these are tiered but I don't know we have this one which are so cute and then we have cats which I don't have cats so I'll be de stashing this so those were the freebies and then into the sheets that I ordered um their paper is really smooth but I got these couples with the dark hair girl and then the brown hair guy with the beard because my husband does have a beard that is more than one sheet I'm like that feels really thick and then we have the diamond painting which I haven't diamond painted in forever but I'm manifesting um sad girls and I did get these in like the mini, like the smallest size cell phone girl. We have a girl eating sushi, the workout sampler type girls, the couple on the co like eating popcorn, probably watching something. Um, I have the curly haired girls this has like a bunch of the little tv services on there i think this is just like i don't know what it's called but like she's celebrating then we have like this little weight loss girl um oh i honestly have no idea why i picked these up they're just so cute so this is a girl holding a chicken like I don't know if you can see the little tiny chicken so cute I just needed them and then we have like the girl and the guy cuddling this curly haired girl with gingerbread cookies detective girl we have the um guinea pigs my guinea pig is actually not this color but I went with this one I think because of just how it would fit with spreads my guinea pig's actually black and she didn't have a black and white one so and then we have the red dog like the little dachshund which this looks just like my daphne and then we have the girl like cuddling the guinea pig and these are like really good sized i don't know what to compare it to my nail here so really excited about these Probably will not be my last order from them. Next day I have an order from Once More With Love. It came in the vellum envelope. And then this is a little freebie. This was for the um, birthday sale she did for Mark's birthday. Hello to a new look. But those are cute. And then I came with this SBC freebie. This is Happy Birthday in Hollow. And then I did put Super Oops in the, um, let me, let me go over this first. So here is the, um, journaling card. Which building has the most stories? A library. But 
that's cute and then I did put super oops in the notes to seller and I got the all you need is love sheet which is so cute so usable I'll use them um I'm gonna assume because it's a little off cut like you see but other than that still usable and then I picked up like I don't know five sheets so I have journal Goblin mode. I don't even know why I got these. I just threw them on there. We have the eggplants, which I'm using with a kit from Leonard Designs. And I'm so happy that I, I got these like a couple days ago. And then the kit that I'm using, that I plan to use these with, is next week. So I got these in like perfect timing. I was starting to stress a little, but we got them. And then happy packages. I have the seven year anniversary favorites. The finger guns gets me. Blowing bubbles. And then film. And that was my little order from Once More With Love. Next, I have an assortment of happy mail from Laurel, um, she did send me more stuff, but since it's not sticker related, I'm not going to include it. Um, it was like a Pua stuffed animal and like treats for my dog and a bag and she's literally just like the nicest person I know. So first I'm going to get into the sticker sheet. Um, this is like Sailor Mercury or Sailor Mars and I am obsessed. I love it. And this is from the Honeybee Shop. And then she sent me this spooky bitch um, die cut, which I love. It's a Moo Point. All my friends, fans know that one. It's the most spooktacular time of the year. Some of these are from Spooky Babe stickers. I myself am, am strange and unusual, and I'm in love with this. I love Beetlejuice, clearly love and then it is like one of my favorite horror movies so this is the dancing clown balloons co and dairy main guaranteed to float so cute so thank you laurel and then these i ordered we basically like placed an order together um from Fox and Cactus, so we can shave on, shave, oh my god, we can shave on shipping. Save on shipping. Here, save me. <laughs> um, so she did send me the journaling card and the, what is this called, freebie? But, really thought those were cute. And then, I picked up like a couple sheets. It's so funny because I had like a cart loaded and I was like, oh, I only want like a few sheets. I don't want to spend the shipping on that. And she's like, she literally like asked me that same day, just a few hours later, was like, do you want anything from Fox and Cactus? And I like sent her my cart. It was already preloaded. So perfect. But we have the weightlifting ghosts, the rude ghosts with middle fingers. I like never use middle finger icons, but. I need them at the same time. And then we have the Me Time plush girls in both the black hair, I think her name's Poppy, and then the colorful one. So cute. I do like that there's ones without the Me Time at the top. Um, since I'm doing monthlies, I'll probably use the ones with the Me Time in my monthly if I ever need to pull it in, but that was my little order from Fox and Cactus via Laurel. Next I have an order from Play With Me Stickers and let me, so she does write my name but my invoice was in there facing outward so. And this is not the first order I placed. I actually placed an order for her birthday sale and this one came faster so I don't know why. This is cute though. I wish I had a house that looked like that. Tiny little apartment. But here is the order. So not only is there like a journaling card, there's a, and this is Happy Holidays. It's definitely February. 
but there is a um this is like rubberized um thank you card too like a little business card and then this is the january freebie happy b day birthday dinner it's my birthday celebrate party and happy birthday i do wish that freebies came in like just the core colors um just because it's going to be hard as hell to match all this to a sparkly gold hollow. Something like that, but it's fine. And then I did pick up four of the whole protector sheets because apparently I'm addicted to those. If you ask um, Maria, she'll say that I am addicted. Let's see, there's enough for four spreads. Yeah, that was my little tiny order from Play With Me Stickers. And then I have an order from Caffeine Queens. I don't remember. I'll type it on the screen, but if there's not like a card in here, this is their name. But hello, I am your personal caffeine companion. Are you satisfied with your caffeine? Oh yeah, it's Caffeine Queens. Oh my God. I just realized it's little B-Max. It's so cute. So, this is just like their business card. Oh, and it has little beans. Oh, wow. That's really cool. I don't think I bought anything with beans. Oh, there's a freebie. That's cute. I wonder if you just get them on your freebies. But, yeah. So, I had seen that another shop was doing this um and basically they how many did i buy oh okay so i bought four and it comes with two so basically they use these and track like where your order shipped to in 2023 i think it was a uh, craft penguin planner something like that and I was like man I really want to do that so that is what I'm going to be doing I'll probably honestly do it while I work and just mark them as I'm doing them um I might have to go back in my orders to get some but these are the continental United States I don't think that no, there's not a picture of Alaska on here, but there are Alaska states, like the state. I haven't gotten an Alaska order in a really long time. Is Hawaii on here? Yep. So I might have to put those, like, off on the sides if I do get orders from them. But these were the maps, so I got four maps. Um, my husband's doing one, too, for his wax shop. And then I got the Bright with the names. I have the Just Brights. And obviously it comes with two. I have Lights and Rainbow. I think I might keep... I think I might give my husband this one. And just keep all three for me. Because I don't know why. I don't know why I bought four. But here we are. So that was my order from Caffeine Queens. Now I have an order from the Honeybee Shop and I will say that I already opened it and took out three items um, because I did have to send them to Laurel for her birthday. I don't understand why this card's in there because it doesn't fit. I just definitely destroyed this package. Um, so four freebies. There's this, like, acetate here to change the world, which it is actually really cute. I really like that. Um, I don't know where I'm going to put it, but I really like it. And then this is the freebie. Oh, I bought this during her birthday sale. Dead inside, but caffeinated. Love that. I actually really like all these, so. Really cute. And then I did pick up 
two sticker sheets. I'm just going to go into them first. So we got the little ghosts. Just like love ghosts. And then the moods. And then I did pick up this little pizza with the pepperonis um, die cut. Um, I did get Laurel because this is going to be going up after she gets it because I literally just packaged it up to send it out tomorrow. Um, I got her some Scream, like the ghost face knife earrings, a ghost face die cut, and something else that was ghost, ghost face so I don't remember what it was but then I did get this enamel pen that says it's okay to make mistakes well the it's okay to doesn't come with it but it was like five bucks and I have a pin board so yeah that was my order from the honeybee shop next I have an order from tiny little tulip it's been a minute since I ordered but she did redo her um foil bundle format and she Included a little note saying that she sent me an extra kitten hollow, which is so sweet. My very thick stack. So, this is the freebie. It's like a little gnome winter freebie, which is really cute. And then the foil bundles. Is that where it ends? My goodness, what did I, what did I order? Okay. So, first bundle I have is a sparkly, um, I don't remember if it's like lime green. It looks kind of like hollow, sparkly ho green hollow. And this is like the first time I'm seeing this new format. Two underlays. And then the scripts, which I actually really love these scripts together. And all of the works on the side. Oh, I love, love so many work scripts. Not that I love working seven days a week, but just in case. And then the bottom washi. This bow's really cute, actually. Oh, and there's like little stars. It's like a star glitter hollow. Hole protectors and then little deco bits. So, really enjoy this. I also think that before her foil bundles, I'm sure I have one, but it only came with like a couple of um, scripts and they were like a lot bigger. So definitely love the reformat of those. And then I did pick up this, I don't remember what it's called, Rose Hollow. It's like a, a pink and it's sparkly. I don't know if you can like you can really see it in this and then the underlays the bottom washi and this one is more of like a sequin underlay or sequin glitter and then the scripts and icons and date numbers oh see it looks like rose there but it's sparkly I really like this foil. I have no idea what I'm using these for, by the way. I just had to grab them. And then, man, how many did I buy? I got this rainbow glitter. And this one's more of like a shattered. And then I think the last one that I ordered is this one. Yeah. So this one's a sparkly orange. And this one has little stars in it too. You can see like a perfect uh, star right there. And they're very like, just because they're confetti, they're very useful for everything. Like very, what's the word? Universal. And then this is the one that she included, which is in hollow. And then 
the scripts and I got. So, I don't know if she watches my videos, but if she does, thank you, Dorian, for the extra. And then next, this is actually my first order from Play With Me Stickers. I just got here after my other one. But there's this card. And then the thank you card, which is like rubberized. It's like really smooth. The happy birthday freebie in gold, like sparkly gold again. And then I did, of course, pick up whole protectors because apparently I'm just addicted to them. But these ones, sorry, my iPad just went off. These ones have bows and I thought that that was really cute. And then I picked up four, four of these terrazzo underlays just because I like the pattern. I did get them unfoiled, even the whole protectors because um, I'll just foil them. I think that creates less overspending, I guess. I don't know. I typically buy foil stuff and foils that I don't own. So yeah, that was my order from Play With Me Stickers. Next, I have an order from Sweet Eve's Paper. Um, I will show the journaling card. And then this is just like the, um, the backing that goes in the cello with it. And then my freebies. So it came with this little freebie pack. And it says thank you on there. And a little notepad that's so cute. And this is fries for four guys. Oh my god. I think my daughter will die for that. And then these little sheets. So I have little snowball pumpkin gas. Um, Monty, I think his name is, with stickers. Nap, Monty. Oh. R.I.P. <laughs> Boo and Lunar. We have this guy that looks like he's doing some intense money stuff. Uh, knitting, Boo and Lunar, or crocheting, I don't know. No, it's knitting, there's two needles. The um, Nightmare Before Christmas ones. Grilling, Dottie, Snowball in a hurry, and then Witch Please. Those are really cute. And then there is this little freebie with the different things on it. I love this little Lydia. I think I have a whole sheet of those. And I don't remember if I picked this up. I don't, if it was new, if it was in the new releases, probably, but I do have this Snowball drinking iced coffee, because it's not like I don't like it. Oh, and then, this is from No White Space Stickers, and they're, like, glittery, kind of like Disney things. There's some stars, castles, um, Mickey faces, like Mickey heads, hearts. Very shiny. And then the order. So we have Snowball with Flowers, Boo and Lunar with Ice Cream, Snowball Pumpkin Coconut Video Games, Television, because I can never have too many of those. These Wizard Desktops, I I got a couple of these uh, different ones that I thought would be great for marking work. Like this will be really good during a Harry Potter spread. Same thing with this, Dark Wizard. We have just Boo and Lunar's desktop, which I am obsessed. And I think my desk probably looks a lot like that. Um, pumpkins, computer desk. We got iced coffee. These are like giant. I don't know if I'll ever use those, but. And then we have the Boo and Lunar collector's toy, which is like a Funko Pop, which is so cute. And then Snowball Red Cart, which is obviously Target. I pick up stuff from Target like 8,000 times a week, so. Yeah, that was my order from Sweet Eva's Paper. Now I have an order from Odd Loop. It's been a while since I've ordered from them, but I didn't want to tear into this because it was so cute. And there's like this little sticker. It says thank you. There's like a little bear face. Is it like a mail bear? 
And then I'm going to order. So first I'm going to get into this pen. I think I said it earlier in this haul. I do have a pen board. And I've been looking for pens for it. And I love Pascal. Love his little cheech attitude, you know. So, had to get that. Can't wait to put them on my board. And then I did get, I think, three kits. And I actually don't mind that they all come in one cello because I always take them out anyway and don't put them back in. But the first one that I picked up is Adams. And I did get it on Glossy. I feel like they've probably changed their format since the last time I ordered because I don't remember this page like at all. And we have like bigger little things and some glitter headers. Date covers and things and then the bottom washi with washi strips. And then I, of course, picked up the Sailor Moon. I feel like I'm going to do, like, a whole Sailor Moon um, themed month. Oh, I picked up four kits. Oh, yeah, I did. Okay. So, Sailor Moon. Let me zoom out a little because they're vertical kits. So, Sailor Mars is my favorite. and stuff which this the format's not like my super favorite but it's not completely unusable and just the art's just too cute so had to get it and then I got Turning Red which I've never even watched this movie but my daughter's obsessed with it so I had to get it I'll have to show her this kit after. This girl loves math. And then lastly, I did pick up the Wally kit, which I just love Wally so much. There's something like, I don't know, I love about his sadness. And these colors are like very bright, like that blue is so bright. And I love that there's so many different colors in Abloop's kits, like that you don't have to. This is weird. Oh, there's more back there, but they're literally not the same color. Anyway, that's going to be interesting. Maybe I'll just like use those too. I don't freaking know. I guess with header overlays, they probably want to look bad. I forgot what I was saying. Something about all the different colors. But yeah, that was my order. Perfect order from Odd Loop. Next, I have an order from SBC. I have the Kittenish Just Freebie. And then this rack bag that's like marble with rose gold, or rose really, it's not gold. And then my order, I did pick up these Pikachus, because why not, they're so cute. And then I did grab the Wakanda Forever kit. Um, I've yet to see the newest movie that came out, but it did come with this like tall box freebie. The boxes. I'm pretty sure that's Michonne, if you know, like from watching. I don't understand what's up with these boxes, but um, watch The Walking Dead, you know who Michonne is. I don't, I don't really love that, like, 
the brighter colors aren't in this. They're very like neutral. I think I just put those upside down with some like purple. Um, but yeah, that was the kit and that was my order from SPC. And then next I have this order from Linera Designs. I ordered three kits, so this one has the freebies, so we're gonna get into this one first. So for the freebies, we have the all orders for January, it's like a blue color. We have, oh my goodness, the $35 plus freebie is the script sampler. We have the like positivity orlays. This is a $50 plus. And this is in a like star hollow. It's actually really cute. I love that. So those were the freebies. And then for the kits I picked up in bloom and I just love the colors of this kit. Like this teal is so pretty. And this VW bus, love that. And this is her new format. I can't wait to use these boxes. I'm using a kit from her right now, like this week. And I struggle because I'm like, I need these size boxes. So can't wait. And then the icons, or not, oh my god, icons, little things. And I am using this this year. I'm actually going to throw it in my lineup right after, but I did pick up the icons and the characters as well. And then next, I picked up Snowdrop, so I won't be using this this year, but I'll probably use it next year, the say February on that. Um because it is a winter kit and we're getting into like spring. I probably won't be spring until like May for us, but sometimes not even. Sometimes it snows around Mother's Day, but. I love the green and the pink combo and like this yellowy color chartreuse I actually have no idea if that's chartreuse but I feel like chartreuse is um yellow I don't know I'm gonna google it okay so it's like a yellowy green it's not that color but I was close and then I did pick up the icons and the characters for that And then lastly, I grabbed Spring Picnic and this I'll, I'll probably actually use closer to June or maybe like in May. Um, I don't have a lot of spring kits actually. I was going through my binder and I don't have a ton so this actually works out. This butterfly pattern is really cute. Oh and then this one's like butterflies but with white. extra boxes, movie marquees, and then the little things. And then obviously for this one, I picked up the icon add-on as well as the characters. And that was everything from Linda Next, I have an order from Glam Planner. Um, she did have a 50% off sale for Valentine's Day. So I took advantage of that. She like never has discounts ever, but I did get this freebie pack, like a rack bag type thing with a bunch of extras in it. I don't know how much of this I'm actually going to keep, but I don't know. Some of it might be useful. So this is like double boxing, a big box. I actually really want this kit now, but label sampler. 
the Cranberry Lane version 5. I think that, no, maybe they're not the same. Some glitter headers, which are fantastic. This girl reading, which these are like really, really big, so I don't know if I'll actually ever use those, but the fashion people for one of the, I don't know, kits. This is Gold Hollow Foil, September 2021, Mystery Extra. I don't know what the kit is. And then there's a lot of these pages. Let me get into these. There's like washi strips or something. Um, I have no idea what that is. And then this is like for a monthly for like the sidebar. I actually really like the little things that go with it. And then this is from the like Western cat. Don't know what this one is from. But it's just like light blues. I love all these little things. This looks like it goes to like a rainy day kit, but I'm not sure. Um, this is like some boho type kit and some floral things. So definitely love getting little freebie bags like that. And then the kits that I got. So I picked up four kits and two of them are Christmas. So yeah, but the first one is the Santa Claus kit and this is a new format. And I do get it in the lock, so it does come with, like, the big box and the double box. Like, the extra double box scene. And Santa Claus is one of my favorite Christmas movies. So, I had to grab it. I wonder if these are, like, people in her life. Man, I don't think I've seen, like, a new, yeah, I have, format. These uh, little things are actually, like, really big. But then you get, like, the two extra down there and then, like, more up here. So it's fine. And then the washi and day covers and whatnot. So that was one kit. And then the next kit is Keeper of Keys. And these are like the add-ons. So you get like the double box scene. I, I literally hate this happy birthday. Like, because in the book, it's literally spelled happy birthday, Harry. It's not like he's, they think that Hagrid's like a dumbass outside of the book. I don't know, but anyway little rant over so I will not be using that book or that box but I still think this is very cute I actually have a sparkly orange um, Harry Potter foil bundle that I'm going to use with this from Alicia Craft did the Santa Claus one have that? I feel like it did not have, oh, okay, it did, it's just pattern different. And then the bottom washing thing, so, not sure when I'll use this, but I wanted to get it to use with that foil bundle, basically. And then there's this Nightmare Before Christmas kit, and it is the old format, so it does come with, like, the big box and then the glitter header separate. Um, I absolutely love the colors of this kit. So I, like, needed it, you know. Um... And this one was like on sale and then the 50% actually came off of the sale price, which was awesome. Um, 
but yeah i think i'll use this in christmas time at christmas time just because it is like heavy on the christmas and then lastly this is like way premature because i haven't even started the house buying process yet but it is one of my goals to get to basically start house shopping the housing market is trash but it's one of my goals for this year so i just wanted to pick this up to be prepared and it came with these extra girls and then the glitter headers because it's the older format and then the full boxes i will probably not own a house that looks like that um it's just not really my style but still And flipping through. I actually really love like these muted pastels. And yeah, that was everything that I picked up from Glam Planner. And then next, I have an order from McPlans. And she always writes your name on this indestructible sticker. Oh, I ripped that time. It's a different sticker, is why. And then I did get Laurel's freebie. I I'm going to trade off between Laurel and Maria, but I did get Laurel's this time, so it is heavily pigs. Like, literally everything's a pig. And then the All Orders freebie. It's kind of like spring, spring cleaning, um, travel. And then the $15 freebie is sports themed, which is really cute. And then I, of course, well, that's not a pig. So I say I, of course, picked up the pig things, but I really didn't only pick up pigs. So first I have these wax melting girls. Literally, I'll probably use these for the rest of my life just because there's so many on one sheet and like, they're so small. I love it. And then I did get the girl with the dark hair and light skin. And then we have the like rain, like spring type sampler. And it's got like rainy day, Easter, and then like St. Patrick's Day. And then I did pick up the pig with the iced coffee. And she has a website now, so that's where I got all of these. And then these little like beer mug pigs, which I will probably use with the Glam Platter Dublin kit um, for St. Patrick's Day week, just because there's like a beer mug, you know, gotta go with the theme. And then I did pick up these rainy day pegs, which I'll probably use throughout my spring spread. So that was my little order from McPlans. And now I have an order from a new to me wax shop, um, which she sent a note and it was like really sweet. But yeah, so I picked up wax for the first time in a really long time. Um, I'm finally like moving through my stash. So I wanted to pick up some things. But it did come with this You Are Magic, and it's Bewitching Wax, if I didn't say that. And then, like, Thank You, All About the Wax, Exoterra, so cute. Um, this little paper clip, which I'm obsessed with, I'm literally going to use it in my, um, or still, like, any plans planner. And then I did get to little die cut stickers so this one says cuddle and feed me tacos and then this one says fries before guys and they're like holographic they're really cute those were the extras and then this was like the freebie and it's i think it's so cute that she's got like a custom mold but this is glinda i'm not sure what it's supposed to be but it smells kind of like cherry chapstick which isn't like a terrible scent i always say things like they sound bad but it's not. Also, I will say that I've already smelled all these before and I have a hard time opening these um, plastic things, so this should be fun. But I think I'm going to start with this one. So this one is Divination Rich Caramel Sweet Tobacco Strawberry Pound Cake and Tea and it's Coconut Wax. I can definitely smell the tea in that. 
and some strawberry pound cake but excited and then we have deep magic this oat milk and honey plus a creamy lavender i definitely smell all of the scents in that i don't know why like i'm showing this part like it's the fun part it's also probably really loud when i'm like trying to open and close them but then we have this one which is herbal magic rosemary sage lavender and apricot i definitely smell like the rosemary and the sage with like a little bit of apricot so let's and then this pretty one with like the snowflakes this is lift the spirit and this frosted morning mist birchwood and lavender it's definitely like a mint lavender i keep freaking doing that but a mint lavender which i like then we have this pretty one here and this is called bewitching passion fruit mango pomegranate and white tea it is very mango heavy or uh yeah, mango heavy, but I needed some fruity, so I had to pick it up. And then we have this pretty pink and white one. This one's called Sisterhood, Delicate Tea Rose, Cherry Blossom, and Black Tea. It definitely smells like rose tea. This is from like me opening the package because I can never do it right, but I really like that one. This one is Sally Hot Freshly Brewed Coffee, Just Baked Beignets, Beignet, is that how you say that, Beignet? And just the right amount of powdered sugar. I just noticed that that said the coven. The Yule Collection, this one, no, it's definitely like a mint. And then this one's the Narnia Collection. I'm just now noticing that they do have the collections on them, but definitely a coffee coffee bakery set this one is sleeping spell which is relaxing lavender lilac and a hint of chamomile and it smells just like that then we have at the altar patchouli sandalwood dried florals and rose petals it is patchouli heavy and i am a super fan of that then we have Light the Candles. This is another Yule collection. The Most Delicious Eggnog and Whipped Coffee, which is a type. <laughs> and it is like a butterscotch scent. I'm so sorry if I'm talking and that is so loud, but it is a like butterscotch type scent. And then lastly, we have Something Wicked. And like, I love the blue on this and like the pink glitter. Ugh. This is fresh berries, creamy butter, fluffy marshmallow, and brown sugar. I definitely smell like the berry and the marshmallow. Um, which is kind of like a weird scent. It's not, not like weird, just like being able to smell the marshmallow. It just smells like a lighter blueberry. Oh, it just says fresh berries, but it's literally, it smells like blueberry. So that was my first order from Bewitching Wax. Next, I have an order from Winter Designs, so I'm going to get into this one first, because it's like the freebies. So, this one has the thank you so much for your, your order card, which is cute. And then this is the February freebie, and I love these colors. Like, they're deep, like, blue and green. Love. And then we have, like, a YouTube freebie. All I care about is pasta. That's cute. Fries before guys. Everything was thinking. Everyone was thinking it. I just said it. This girl runs on caffeine and sarcasm. Same though. I don't know why I love to peel those up. And then we have the $25 plus freebie. I think these are actually different than her one before. Which I don't have any out right now. And then we have the... This It has to be different because it's February. I don't know if I spent that much. Did I? No. So, thank you, Lynn, for including all of these. But this is upside down. And this is like a silver flower. 
um, bottom washi for the $50 and then the 100 plus is a gold like self-care like self-love type overlays which I love and I love that they're gold because I like have no problem bringing them in and then she did include these two because she watched my haul and saw that I said that I forgot to pick up two so this is in blue hollow and then this one's like the coral color which I think will look so good with the kit so thank you Lynn for those and then the kits so I'm gonna go with the non-exclusive art first because worst to best even though it's not bad like I wouldn't buy them if I didn't like the art so I'm just saving the best for last I guess I should have said but this is the birthday kit so this is called birthday bash this is Darcy art and there's the full boxes and then the um bottom washi and date covers an extra box I know that her labels are changing I think I'm using her exclusive art in March, her one of her exclusive art, like with the new format in March, and I cannot wait. And then the extra boxes here, I'll probably use this for my birthday, maybe, I don't know. But with this kit, I got the icon add-on and then the character add-on as well, and the printable foil bundle so I am gonna flip through this I did print this I did not foil it yet um she has this in shop as like either printable or buying it but I love the underlays they're so cute oh my god why is the car being so loud right now but I'm not sure which color I'm gonna use with this I think that gold would go pretty well, but I don't know. I have like months to figure it out, so I'm not too concerned, but that is birthday bash. And then we have Teddy Bread, which is so funny because she called it Teddy Graham. So this is the Teddy Graham kit. And just these little breads are so cute. And then this little teddy bear there. I love like the muted colors of this because they are like kind of like neutral but also not like with the purple and like the tan. I mean tan's pretty neutral but I don't know. I just like the mix. I think that's a coffee cup with like a sink and or a sink a ship in it and then the little things and then of course with this one I got the icons and the oh characters and then I think I might have actually picked these up because this girl has stretch marks and I love that so I do get her kits in glossy and then I get the like add-ons in her matte vinyl. But so cute. And then I did, of course, get the printable foil bundle. This is obviously Teddy Brad. And then the underlays, which are so freaking cute. So. Love this. Have no idea when I'm going to be using it, but I still had to get it. I just. I just stuck the cello to that and now like the ink's pulled off of it. I wonder if she'll be able to send me like a full box. Uh, so I'll text her about that. I don't know if I picked that up. Anyway. Sad. 
Um, this is the exclusive art that she came out with. It's called Crime Junkie, of course. I know that she was deciding between two different color palettes and I think this is like the one to go with and I freaking love this kit and I've seen it so like everybody talks about it they love it too I love that for her so much so this is the kit or these are the full boxes and then the bottom washi and extra box extra well like boxes solid boxes glitter headers deco and other things over here i love that and the little things and then for this i don't know if i picked these up but if she included them thank you lynn i actually really love this girl i might have picked these ones up and not the other ones i'm trying to think I don't know. I could look at my order, but I'm too lazy. So thank you, Lynn, if you did. And then I did pick up the icons and the characters. And of course, I bought all of the printable things. I mean, I didn't buy them all. I did pick and choose, but there's this blood splatter um, foil bundle that I picked up. And then this has like the bow, which is very like, um, like kind of generic for it. And then blood spider underlays. And then I did pick up the fingerprint. That's upside down. Washi. Because why not? And it came in like three. So now I have three. That's how like the printable file was. But, and then same thing with this. I have four of these that's how the printable file was and I'm just I don't crop it I just literally go with it so I think she's got like a bunch of different ones honestly I think I just like these ones the most for this kit so yeah that was my order from Leonard Designs so sad about that lastly I have an order from Leonard Designs um again <laughs> These are going to be my Easter kits, but freebies first. So, for the freebies, you get the, oh, this is the all orders for February. And the script sampler freebie, the YouTube freebie, the $50 plus. I'm 1000% sure that I did not spend this much, but... She likes to spoil me, so that's the $50, and then these are the $100, and I love that they're just like in basic foil colors too because it makes it so much easier to pull into spreads. I know they're not always in basic foil colors, but you know. Anywho, into the first kit. So this is the Kittness Jess art. Okay, so this is Sugar Bunny. I just had to tell my twins to quiet down they're playing but they're being loud I literally couldn't decide between the two so I decided that I was doing two Easter spreads this year but I really hope that you can't still hear my kids because I said be quiet and they're not quiet oh my god that's so cute little bunny ear pods ear pods air pods <laughs> but that was the kit which i do always get in glossy and then i pick up the icons and characters in matte and then i also grabbed the easter weekend kit and it's so cute and i love the colors like i love this little flat layer here This double box scene and then the little things 
And then for this kit, of course, I also picked up the icons and the characters. And that was it for... No, oh, just kidding. And then I did get the printable foil kits. The foil packs. And I did, I did print cut too. I'm just showing one. Um, it is obviously like egg Easter theme. This says Happy Easter on it. And then I obviously haven't foiled this yet. I'm not really sure what foil color I'm going to be using with these. But... I'll figure it out when I go to use some scripts and icons. This is like the, I also love that she's included the deco bits in her kits now, or her foil packs now. Um, and then the underlays, which are really cute. So, that was my order from Winter Designs. And that was everything for my February haul. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you have not already, and I will see you next time.